President Tsai Ing-wen arrived in El Salvador for a state visit on January 13th, Taipei time. She was traveling from Guatemala, where she delivered a speech to its Congress. She is very interested in the efforts by Central American countries to upgrade their industries. She also said the Republic of China would try out a new diplomatic approach that focuses on mutually beneficial cooperation projects. President Tsai Ing-wen arrived in El Salvador at 6.30 a.m. on January 13, Taipei time. She was received by Salvadoran Foreign Minister Hugo Martinez. During her time in El Salvador, Tsai Ing-wen with Salvadoran students who studied in Taiwan on government scholarships and also attended the presentation of teaching materials from Taiwan manufacturers to El Salvador's Ministry of Education. During this trip to visit the Republic of China's Central American allies, the president has repeatedly said she hopes to use educational cooperation programs to help the nation's allies cultivate talents. She would also like to see Taiwan civic organizations participate in these programs. The president has also reiterated her practical diplomacy mutual assistance approach to foreign relations during this trip. She hopes to see cooperation in the areas of education, medical treatment and construction. Tsai visited Guatemala prior to arriving in El Salvador. In a speech to the Guatemalan Congress, she said the Republic of China will assist its Central American allies in upgrading their industries. The president also wrote the words, Fight for Democracy, Pursue Liberty, in the Congress's guest book. The previous page had a message left by former President Ma ying during his March 2016 visit to the Guatemalan Congress. While Ma spoke about his many achievements during his eight years in office and the 1992 consensus, Tsai listed the many ways the Republic of China has assisted Guatemala in recent years, including constructing highways, providing medical treatment, narrowing the digital divide, and training farmers in growing papayas. She said Taiwan has invested over 100 million U.S. dollars in Guatemala and promised to organize investigatory trips for Taiwanese businesspersons in the future.